Hey, what is good, buddies? Welcome back. My name is Beaker. We are back at it with the Clash Royale today. Back at it with the YT. And uh, it's going to be sick, guys. We've got some great raids lined up for you guys. There are going to be a couple of mismatches. You guys may have heard I, I kind of like mismatches. <laughs> My clanmates seem to always be sharing raids matches that have level 10 versus level 8. It's like the, it's like the sweet spot. So we're going to check out a couple of those. And then we'll do a live raid ourselves. What do we got here? What? There was a mini dragon, but then it got blown up by a couple of minions. So everything has been countered so far. What's going on over here? We've got a a balloon going one way, a P.E.K.K.A. going the other way. We've got some heavy hitters here, but none of them are really getting to where they need to go. Except for that balloon. You got... Oh! Wow. Okay, so that balloon, just one balloon, got to its mark and did some crazy damage. You guys notice that? I mean, balloon is like pretty crazy. It's slow. And it's expensive, but if it hits its mark, boom. Like, you are seriously done. I think the best thing about the, the balloon is it hits right when it gets there. Right when it gets there, it'll go boom. Instead of waiting, you know, it doesn't have any sort of weight at all. I'm kind of surprised about that. I would think the balloon would have a slight, tiny little weight. But anyway, Rocky Balboa. What, what, what's good? Rocky from, from the movie. You guys get it. <laughs> Rocky Balboa is in the, in the lead here. He's... uh. I can't even make a Rocky joke right now. I'm sorry. He's trying to knock out Snake. I I, I, I tried. Tried my best. <laughs> anyway, Rocky is trying to knock out Snake. He's trying to get the three here, and it's kind of like he's he's ignoring the fact that Snake could still win. You guys see that? Snake just sniggled up the right side and got a ton of hits on that right tower with a balloon. It's like Rocky was just like, whatever. What's your balloon going to do? Nothing. What? There, we have another good example. <laughs> he just dropped a prince right underneath some minions. It's like, oh, okay, nice. And now again, the balloon is coming up the right side. Snake is gonna get it. If you ignore balloons, you get wrecked. <laughs> Can we get that quote up on the screen here? I think, I, I think I'm gonna put it on the screen. Anyway, uh, we're still going here. Boom. Snake just got the right tower. <laughs> so it's, it's just kind of funny, right? Like a level 10 player gets kind of overconfident. And he's like, oh, I'm good. I'm just going to go for the three. And uh, then it's all tied up. All of a sudden, all tied up. So look at this here. We got a lot going on here. The P.E.K.K.A. did not make it. It's pretty easy to counter the P.E.K.K.A. But the balloon did make it. Got some good shots in there. And Snake is like in a heated battle. <laughs> trying, to, trying to do some more boxing jokes here. I, boxing joke for days. Not really. But uh, you, you get what I mean. Snake is still going for the three. I mean, no. Rocky is still going for the three. And Snake is just trying to whittle away at that left tower. So, let's see if he can do what he can do. <laughs> let's see if he can do it. He's going to keep just trying to defend his king tower. Looking pretty good. And now he sends the balloon in. Look, Rocky seems to have not even noticed it's happened yet. Oh, he throws some arrows. You're too late, buddy. Boom! <laughs> A little, little round of applause for Snake there. That was sick. That was sick. That was just barely in overtime. I think overtime had like just pretty much started. So the next tower was going to win it. Snake gets it. <laughs> you know, there's another kind of dangerous thing that happens when you start going for the three crown. You kind of get addicted to it. You're like, well, I've already started. I might as well keep going. You guys ever see that? Anyway, we got another one here with a level 10 versus a level 8. As we just showed you guys. And this guy's going to start right off the bat here with a level 8 hog. What? Hi. Hi, level 8 hog. How are you? <laughs> Doing good? Yeah, buddy. Woo! So that level 8 hog got uh, no hits in. Nice. Cool. So, you know, if you, if you stay on the defense and you really just... Especially if you use defensive buildings, you can take on really high-level cards with, with no problem. And as you can see, Beatdown is doing a good job here so far. And he already got a ton of hits in on that left side. That was with the hog barb combo, which is a sick combo. I use I use that in my deck. And hog and barbs is so sick because the barbs almost like surround the hog rider and they just sneak up there. And if any of them get there, hog or barbs, they're gonna do serious damage. Anyway, guys, uh, what, what's going on now? Um, looks like it's pretty much tied up here. Another hog, just just a hog. Just throw the hog, see what happens. How's that going? Not too good? No. No. Usually, you're gonna want to throw the hog with some other troops. <laughs> okay, anyway. <laughs> as I say that, Beatdown throws a hog up the field and it gets to its mark and does some serious damage. 
Nice. A little zap action. Was that the zap? Yeah, I think that was. Pretty sick, uh, pretty sick as far as defense goes. You can zap a group like that. Works pretty good. Anyway, yeah, uh, we're, we're still looking pretty good here. Um, Beatdown is gonna get that left tower, it looks like. There's still a Tesla to go through, but uh, I think he can make it. What's this? Uh, oh! Oh, I thought we were gonna see a face-off between that bomber and that wizard. Who who else wanted to see that? <laughs> anyway, uh, whoa, whoa, dangerous group right there. What? Okay. They're done. <laughs> They're pretty much done. So Barb's with a wizard is so sick. I use it. It's in my deck. I have, you know, like I'll show you guys later. We'll, we're gonna do a live raid. But I, I usually use Hog, uh, Wizard if I can, some Barb's. Those are some great troops. And if you mix any combination of those, you're gonna get some hits in. So while I was rambling, it appears Beatdown got the tower. <laughs> what? He he got the tower? Wow. I kind of missed it, but anyway, the moral of the story is, dude, you can't give up. I mean, this guy was level 10. He had some inc insane cards and still beat down. <laughs> Look at that. I love defending with the little bomber guy. The bomber guy is so sick. He's got a lot of damage. He does splash damage and he's really cheap. So anyways, guys, <laughs> that was sick. DD, nice try, I, I guess. Uh, cool. Awesome. We're going to go do a live match right now. See what we can do. Maybe scare up some wins. Here we go. All right, buddies. Here it is. We got a level seven player here. Nice. Okay. So we're, we're kind of at an advantage here. Let's see what we can do. I'm going to wait for him to make the first move. Hopefully. Oh, he's got a bomb tower. Oh, I hate bomb towers. They're pretty effective. Pretty effective. So we're going to drop a hog rider just to start to start to sort of whittle away at that thing. I'm gonna drop the minions too, I guess. He zaps. I think we can take it out right here. Okay, good. Get it! Yeah, that did nothing. <laughs> now we're back at square one. Nice! Okay, so we're gonna go up the other side here with um, Barb Wizard because we know he already used... Oh, no. I was gonna say, he already used his zap, so I thought that would be pretty effective. Turns out... It really wasn't. I mean, we got a couple shots in, so that's good. So we're taking out the witch. Yes! <laughs> a little overhyped there, Beak. But uh, we're we're good. We haven't gotten hit at all yet. And we've gotten some shots in on the left side. So I guess we're going to go up the left side. Um, there's your awesome bomb tower. <laughs> I love the bomb tower. Did I mention that yet? Cool. Awesome. So maybe we'll do a dragon hog push. I mean, I... I should be waiting for him to go first. That's what that's what you normally want to be doing. Wait for him to go first, and then I can defend and push up. But um, that's not working, is it? <laughs> go get it, get it, please get it. Ah, no! <laughs> What's he gonna drop now? Nothing. He doesn't have any more elixir. Oh, he <laughs> he had the freeze. I thought he was gonna drop something and crush me. That was actually pretty good for me because. It just slowed him, you know, it just slowed everything down. It wasn't a big deal. So uh, let's drop um, barbs. That should counter everybody here. Kill the witch, kill the witch. Yes. Okay, now kill. Hurry. Hurry, kill. Whoa. Ah. <laughs> no. Giant is surprisingly good, man. You guys ever notice, like, giant? You can't be sleeping on the giant. He, he doesn't look like he's going to be that good of a troop. He is sick. He's sick, especially for lower level people. You know, he's very handy to have. So, oh no! Ah! <laughs> Hiya! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Shoot, dragon, what? Oh, okay, we got one fireball down there. Word. S uh, what's this guy's name? Senor Wenderson. <laughs> I love the name, buddy. Love it. So let's drop that. Oh, no, what, 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 uh, what was that? What did I just say, by the way? Okay, so we got a nice push here, ready to go. He already uses Zap, so we probably don't have to worry about that. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> Get up there, yeah! <laughs> what? Yeah, we got it now. <laughs> okay. okay, guys, so see, we had a great example there of moving from defense to offense, and that push is what got us the win. Now, of course, this guy was a little lower level than us, but you know what? Good game. Um, you know, we had an unfair advantage there for sure. It was a mismatch and we were the, uh, 
the mismatch. <laughs> what you get what I mean? We we played okay and we got the win. So I had fun. Anyways, let me know what you guys thought about this Clash Royale video. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.